Hey guys, it's Jasmine. So I'm here with another video for you guys and today this video will be about J. Manuel Beauty and I'm sure you guys know who J. Manuel is. I've loved him ever since like forever and if you don't know who he is, he was um one of the judges on America's Next Top Model and yeah, that's how you should just spark your memory of who he is if you do not know him if you did watch america's next time model but yeah so he has his own makeup um collection now that is exclusively sold on hsn.com um that's where you can purchase it also on his j manual beauty website which all of those links will be down below in the description box so when they reached out to me i was very excited because like i immediately was like oh my god yes j manual has a makeup line i want to try it so yeah I agreed and I just wanted to give you a quick review and also at the end of this video it will be a quick um, demo to show you guys how some of the products performed um, so yeah let's just get right into it so they sent me some of their um, filter finish collection powder to cream foundations which is in a cute packaging like this all the packaging is very cute and sleek very very nice um like this black matte packaging but this kind it doesn't look like it would get too many fingerprints on it like the nars packaging even though i love the nars packaging even though it does do that whatever but yeah so here's the packaging it just has j manual and then the beauty is in like this orangey ready color which is very cute and sleek and then I also was sent like a lipstick or two and this is the lipstick. These are called um, the everything lipstick or something. Oh, the ultimate lipstick. So I was sent um, a few of their ultimate lipsticks and this is in the color Love Bite. And it's the color I'm wearing right now with one of the lip glosses on top. Here's the swatch to the Love Bite lipstick. It's very creamy and yeah, here it is. And again, this color is called Love Bite, and it's the ultimate lipstick. On top of the lipstick, I applied some of this lip gloss, and this is called Charisma. And this is a very pretty new color to wear on its own. It's just very gorgeous. I love this color. Oh my gosh. And it's very glossy, but it still has a great color payoff. This is the lip gloss like super cute this is in charisma again and like the applicator is pretty weird it's like not a brush it's like a silicone applicator i don't know if you guys can see that but it's like hard that's pretty weird i've never seen that before but it's cool and the packaging is super cute still nice and sleek so these are the lip and eye pencils so you can use them for both i have the colors glow and hex and one of them is like a brown color, like a brownie purpley color. And then the other one is like a shimmery champagne color. And I did use both of these in the demo. Um, I used the brownish color on my lips just to line it a bit and give it a little bit of dimension. And then I used glow on my bottom lash line and also in the inner corner. These are very creamy and smooth, especially this brownish purple color. Like this works amazingly. I can swatch it for you guys. Like, it's super creamy and very, very pigmented. And then this is the glow color. It's just a champagne-y color. This one isn't as creamy as the brown one, but it's still very creamy. Also, they have this product called the Filter Finish Skin Facelift. And this is what it looks like and it's just like a highlighter but it comes with like a brush little applicator so you just brush it on and you can see the product right there it comes out the center and it's just a very nice glowy it's like kind of that lit from within look I use it today and you can kind of see it on camera but it's like a very nice subtle glow so these um cream to or powder to cream foundations i'm not a huge fan of but that just that is probably just because i do not like the cream to powder or powder to cream stuff in general i'm not a huge fan of them so i wasn't too like fond of this but it did give me a great coverage um i would say it's pretty light to medium coverage but if you like that um more and it's like i feel like you can build it up as well i used a damp beauty blender so i haven't tried it with a brush or anything the times so i've used it i've used it both with um both like all the times with a damp beauty blender sponge 
so yeah i'm not a huge fan of this but i can definitely see people loving this if you do love the cream to powder or powder to cream formulas i'm a girl i just like either a powder or a, a liquid foundation um so yeah also they have um powders as well and if you can see this packaging is just so cute i freaking love it so guys it's so nice and sleek and just i love the packaging it's like everything this is called the filter finish collection luxe powder and this is in the color deep filter 2 and it's like a really nice powder very creamy and buttery if you guys can see it and all the um compacts come with a big mirror which is really nice especially like for traveling and if you just do your makeup and you like to have a mirror to hold like this is perfect um the powders i would say it's just to set foundations and stuff i wouldn't just use that as a foundation alone um i think it's solely just to set pow set your makeup um, but again, I haven't tried it just alone without a foundation. And in the collection, they also have blushes. This is called a Soft Focus Powder Blush. And I ha this is in the color Tease. And I have another one, but this is my absolute favorite one. And they also come with little brushes. I don't know where my brush is. Yeah, I don't know where the brush that came with it is. But it does come with like a little brush. And then it also has a mirror, if you guys can see. I'm sure I just blind you guys. And you can see better in this one, all the powder products come with the J and the M for J Manual, which is so cute. Um, it's really, really nice. And again, this blush is Tease, and this is the one I used in the tutorial. Here it is swatched. And here it is swatched on my skin. It's right here. Super pretty, like one of my favorite pink blushes. It's like super nice and I just love it. And it has a slight sheen to it, but it's pretty matte. And then they also have these little eyeshadow quads. And this is the Intense Color Eyeshadow Quad. And I have the color Crave, if I could get that out. Um, so here it is. I'm not a huge fan of this color selection. There's another one that's on the website that I absolutely love. I think there's like two more that I absolutely love on the site. But this is the one they sent me and in the video I used this like goldy champagne color which is very nice and pigmented. Um, this is definitely my favorite color in the palette. I don't know if you guys can see. I can swatch it for you guys. It's right here. It's very nice and pigmented. And then I also use this brownie, purpley color. Um, it kicked. This color is very, very powdery. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it kicked up a lot of so products. Yeah, it's a pretty palette. Um, it's just not my favorite just because of the colors but if you guys love these colors i think you would love so the also what's cool about them is i'm pretty sure iman cosmetics is like their kind of like the same brand or company like they create they help create um j manu beauty um iman cosmetics which is really cool um also um j manu beauty j manual beauty they have this um app that you can download on your phone um, called J Manual Beauty and it helps you pick the colors um, you will just take a picture in natural lighting and it helps you um, decide which color you would be in their products which is pretty cool also another cool thing um, about their brand J Manual's brand is that they have like three different styles of makeup I was chose for the classic style so I got all of the products in the classic range they have classic iconic and avant-garde which is pretty cool so based on the look that you like to um where you would choose products from each um section like classic that's where I chose from or that's where they chose from for me and then if you like more iconic makeup you can choose from iconic or if, or if you like avant-garde you choose from avant-garde like they have a list a category which lists all the makeup in that spectrum and then if you just want to have a taste of everything then you can just order whatever you want to order and pick from whichever categories multiple categories two categories just depends on your taste in makeup so again in my taste in the um collection that i received all of the products that i received are from the classic collection so yeah that's about it um like i said i did do a quick little demo on some other products and i use pretty much all the products that i 
um, mention today in this video I used in the demo and you guys will see how they performed um, I didn't have like a contour or my eyebrows so my eyebrows weren't shown contour and stuff and I did use another eyeshadow color um, just to help transition I did not add lashes to this look just because I wanted you guys to see how the mascara performed which I absolutely love the mascara like it's called the everything mascara and I absolutely love it did I show you guys so this is the everything mascara the packaging again is nice cute and sleek and the brush is a rubberized brush and I absolutely love it I love this mascara I think the mascara performed really well on my eyelashes like they did a it did a great job with lip lengthening and also defining them so I absolutely love this mascara like seriously life um, my favorite products will have to be the mascara the blushes and the lip products um, and the lip so pencils. I will have all the links to the products I mentioned in this video down below as well as the HSN store and the J Manuel Beauty website so make sure you guys check that out and if you want to see a little demo of this um, makeup tutorial just make sure you stay tuned and also give this video a like thumbs up and also subscribe and comment so if you want to see the makeup tutorial or the quick little demo i did just stay tuned and i'll see you guys in my next video bye okay guys so now on to the demo i'm gonna start off i did prime my eyelids but i did not show you guys in this clip i'm using the j manual beauty um eyeshadow quad in the color crave and i'm using the shimmery champagne color and i'm just packing that on my lid and like I said, I did use a primer. I just didn't show you guys because I'm just solely showing you guys the products from J Manual, Be J Manual Beauty. Sorry. And this color is definitely my favorite. Love it. It's definitely very pigmented. So the next color I use is this brownish color, which isn't my favorite because I feel like it isn't as pigmented. But it does work, especially if you may be a tad lighter than me. Um, and then you just have to build it up. So I'm just using that to blend out the silver or champagne color. And I did use like a warm brown shadow to blend out these colors a little bit better. I just didn't show you. You can use any warm tone brown if you want to create this look. But I did use another shadow. So now I'm going to show you the Everything Mascara, which I freaking love this mascara. Like... It's so good and it works so well on my lashes. Definitely one of my favorite products from them. So basically I just wanted to show you guys how these products performed. I wasn't doing like a complete makeup tutorial on this total look. Just the products that I was sent by J Manuel Beauty. So next I'm going to move on to the face and I'm using the J Manuel, J Manuel Beauty Filter Finish Collection Powder to Cream Foundation and I use the color Deep Filter 2 and I'm using that with a damp beauty blender sponge and this gave a really sheer coverage for me um, but it is pretty buildable. Um, I put only one layer on though pretty much and I just showed you guys half of my face so you can see the difference. And I did prime my face as well with um, a silicone based primer. So now moving on to face powder. I just set my face. I did apply a concealer under my eyes. Um, but it was not from J Manuel. And I used the Filter Finish Collection Luxe Powder in the color Deep Filter 2 to set my face. And then moving on to blush. They do have contour or bronzers, but the ones they sent did not work for my skin tone. They were too light. So I used one of my other ones, and then I'm using the J Manuel blush, the Soft Focus Powder Blush in the color Tease, which is now my favorite blush. I love this. I use this on a daily basis now. And then to give me a bit of a highlight, I used their um, Filter Collection Skin Facelift. And this is just a very subtle highlight. It gives you that lit from within glow, which I do like on some days. And then moving back to the eyes, I use the J Manual Beauty um, 
lip and eye pencil and it's the everything pencil and I use the color glow and I use that to give me that champagne glow and to brighten my eyes on my bottom lash line and also in the inner corner of my eyes. And this worked perfectly as well. I love these this pencil too. And then I went on and used the Everything Mascara again with, for my bottom lashes, which again, I love. And then moving on to the lips, I used the J. Manuel Beauty, um, the Ultimate Lipstick. And this is in the color Love Bite. But this is just a pink color. It is very opaque. And this is a very creamy lipstick, which I did enjoy. Just your classic pink lip. And then to give me a little dimension, I used the Everything Pencil in the color Hex. And I applied a little bit and then blended it, blended it out with my fingers because it is like a very dark color for this lipstick. But it still works as long as you blend it, blend, apply some more, blend it out, and then apply some more. And then to give me a little bit of gloss on top of that, I used the J. Manuel Beauty Lip Gloss. And this is in the color Charisma. And I love this lip gloss as well. This is like one of my everyday colors now. Like it's just perfect. When I'm going to work, I just pop this on and it just gives me the perfect wash of color that I love. It's like a nudie pink color. And then basically guys, that's the completed demo. I hope you guys enjoyed this and I'll see you guys in my next video. Please check out J Manuel Beauty and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!